Netcasts you love. From people you trust. This is Twit. Audio bandwidth for the Daily Gizwiz is provided by Winamp. Subscribe to the Daily Gizwiz and all your favorite podcasts with the ultimate media player. Download it for free at winamp.com. Video bandwidth for the Daily Gizwiz is provided by Cashfly at C A C H E F L Y dot com. It's time for the Daily Gizwiz with Mad's maddest writer, Dick D. Bartolo. This is episode 1208 for October 27th, 2010. The iPod Touch. And now, get ready for Dick. Middle of the week. It's Wednesday. Time. I don't have a Wednesday song, really. No theme thing. I could sing the Monday song over again. No! It's Wednesday! Theme Tree Wednesday, the show you cannot hump. There's no way! The day when there's no theme. Even though there's no theme, unfortunately, there still are two hosts, me and Dickie D. Hey, Dick. Oh, Dick, hold on. Holding I turned, up? I, I, I connected your audio with those cables. <laughs> we didn't Do hear I you. For, now I hear you. <laughs> Do you hear me now? Okay. No, Do I, I sound clear? Clear. Are you using clean? a clean, crisp DAC? I wouldn't do anything without it. I brushed yeah. my teeth with them this That's morning. Lovely. Now we lovely. put Jamma B on the case. Mm. Jamma, yeah, Jamma B. Is he, yeah, we're Jamma talking B. about yesterday's Turn the Tables Tuesday. And I have to, first of all, apologize because. You know, I gave them short shrift. I probably should have taken those out of the box and reviewed them before talking about them. So I gave you all short shrift. We're talking about the HRT Music Streamer. It's it's asynchronous twenty four ninety six for a mere hundred fifty dollars, which apparently is a very good price. Jammer B, who is an audiophile, has come in from vacation to test this thing. So we'll have a Jammer more B is so fussy about sound oh he is that he does not even use those white earbuds that come with the ipod no. that's yeah that's no. how yes. professional he is. yes no in fact ladies and gentlemen jammer b we we don't call him a sound engineer we call him an audio caresser because correct he caresses the audio yep yeah note by note <laughs> Inch by inch. So we'll give you a much more elaborate review of the HRT2 uh, later in the week or maybe next week on my Turn the Table Tuesday. Meanwhile, your turn, Dick, to actually Yeah, well, you know, what? It's, it's so funny because yesterday you said, you know, I did the iPhone. Did I do the iPad? Yeah. And, but, but what I was thinking when, when I selected this gadget is you did the iPhone. I, right. I'm not sure if you did the iPad. I think you did. And you also did the little Nano, which was... I did. The Nano. What, what, did it have a different name? Yeah, now it's just the, the newest Nano. I think it's the fifth or sixth generation Nano. I love it, right. by the way. I'm still using yeah. it. I use it in the car. Yeah. yeah. Well, you skipped over the mid-range gadget that I just got and absolutely love it is the Generation 4 iPad, uh, iPod Touch. Oh, I'm so interested. This is the one that now uses the Retina display. It really is like an I iPad Mini. You know, Leo, it is so great because it's Wi-Fi enabled. Right. It has that little. Uh, I guess iPhone has it too. Uh, FaceTime. Right. Where you can, it, it's it's essentially like Apple's version of Skype. Right. Where if you're two people in a Wi-Fi area, I've made several. Uh, face talk uh, calls and they're amazing and I'm thinking boy you know if you're at a convention and most conventions are, are Wi-Fi enabled and you want to show someone back home hey I just saw this great gadget you can use FaceTime to you can either use the front facing camera or the rear facing camera there's a little button that switches between which camera the person on the other end is seeing. Uh, I, I love that. The screen is amazing. And what I'm not sure, Leo, is Jamma B and I actually held our the, uh, the, the, the touch against the iPhone. 
I'm not sure if they're using the exact same display or not. They are using the same display. The cameras are not the same, and that's something you yes. should be aware of. Yes, and, and yes, the still camera, I've only shot stills with it. The still camera is okay. Uh, indoors, oh, sorry. What? Oh, 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 sorry. Got excited. Is it that new uh, thing you hooked up? Yes, that's it works. <laughs> They should have like a switch that lets you turn it on when you want to. That's the only slight drawback. Uh, never mind. <laughs> pay no attention. Pay no attention to the man. Pay attention the to the man with the audio <laughs> screw-on cable. Whoops. <laughs> it's working. It's working. It's oh, working. okay. That yeah. was playing. That was it playing. Listen, can you hear it? Yeah, Jammer B's loving it. Actually, he's jamming to oh. it. Yeah. Okay. So okay. we, we did, we did, it was me, it was my error, and it's working great. Okay. Okay. Meanwhile. Um, meanwhile, <laughs> so our screens are the same, the cameras uh, are not. That's exactly, that, that's my understanding, absolutely, yeah. Okay, yeah, because indoors, the picture's a little bit grainy. Outdoors, the shots are really good, but indoors, it, it's... Well, it's, it's a lower not... resolution camera. You know, the camera in the uh, in the iPhone is a, is a, actually very good, very high quality 5 megapixel camera. Yours is not. I, it's like 960. You know what, I, someone told me that it, you're actually using a still store from the video camera yeah. when you take still pictures. Yeah. So it, it, it's, it's a little bit grainy. Yeah. Uh, um, what else do I... So uh, the keyboard, you know, we, we must have pretty much... What, Leo, but it, it, is the iPhone screen a touch bigger? You're saying it's exactly the same I mean, It's size. my understanding it's the same, but, you know, I'll have to check the specs on that. So see, it looks a little smaller to you. It, it it did look a touch small, but it might just be the the uh, black border around that has Retina display, which is really a crisp oh, uh, screen. Yeah, and you know a lot of the same apps. You can even it's do, the same resolution. It says eight nine sixty by six forty at three hundred oh, wow. at three hundred twenty six pixels per inch. So it is the same three and a half inch screen as you'd find on an iPhone. And, and then I'm going through the little uh, Quick Start menu, and it says setting up Bluetooth, and I'm going. This has Bluetooth also. Yeah. So it has a lot of, it has the uh, Nike uh, iPod thing if you're a runner and you're using that. Safari. Really? Uh, it's got everything except the the, yeah. the cell phone stuff, the 3G and the phone calls. Yeah. yeah. And starts at 229 for 8 gigabytes. 290. Certainly you want to go to at least the 32 gigabytes because it's only $70 more for four times the memory. And then 64 gigabytes is 399, so it's sort of getting up there. But I, I'm really happy with this. Uh, I put Bongo on it, so you can, you know, Bongo is the service where you pay ten dollars a month, and you can use uh, Wi-Fi hotspots from many different, like uh, from uh, uh, T-Mobile. You, you mean Boingo? Oh, Boingo. Sorry, what did I call it? Bongo. 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 <laughs> See, if I had a clear audio thing... Where That's I, what you need. You need a 96-bit uh, uh, DAC. I do. I yeah. do. That I could hook to this iPod. Uh, to this, uh, I to so this is this your first iPod? You've had other iPods. Right? Yes. No, I've had lots of iPods, but okay. all the little guys, the little shuffle... You never had a touch uh, before. I never had a touch before. And you never before. had an iPhone before either, have you? I don't have one now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I think but for no. somebody who doesn't want an AT&T monthly bill... But wants all the functionality, wants the apps and everything. The iPod Touch is a very good choice. I like it a lot. Yeah. And, you know, I love playing in the app store and downloading stuff. I got to get has... you on Instagram. You know about Instagram? No. Yeah, this would work with the iPod Touch. I use it on an iPhone, but it's a free program that lets you take pictures and you can put little effects on the pictures and post them. It's kind of like a Twitter for pictures. And actually, it will also oh. post to your Twitter. So if you take a, a fun picture, you can... You can post it over to uh, to your Twitter. And what's it called? It's Instagram? called Instagram. Yeah, I like it. It's a fun app for uh, the iPhone and the iPod Touch. Wow, okay. Yeah. I'll get that too, yeah. I'm yeah. slowly filling up all my screens. But you can have a ton of screens. Oh, yeah. And then you can put folders too. So you can have really many, many more apps than before. You know about the folders, right? Um, this is something new. Okay, Take, no, I don't know, you know about press. Folders. You know how on an iPhone or iPod Touch, when you press and hold an icon... Yeah, it starts yes, to you can jiggle. move it around. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, well, if you take it and you drag it onto another icon, drag it onto one that's related, like, you know, take two games and drag one game onto another game, it'll create a folder named Games and put the put the two oh, of them into that. 
So you'll never run out of space. Well, not never, but it you can hold hundreds more. Yeah, uh, yeah absolutely. Yeah. 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 Wow. So I think you. I think uh, you. I be very curious to see how you like that in the long run. Yeah, no, uh, I've had it just for, I think, two weeks now, and I like it a uh, lot. I think they've done a I nice love, job. I love FaceTime, and I love the Wi-Fi. Well, good, now I can FaceTime you. Yeah! We can stop using the Skype thing, and we can just do the whole show on our phone. Show on FaceTime. Exactly, walking around the street. It'll be we'll awesome. Stay, I'll, have, I'll have to do it from McDonald's, because they have free Wi-Fi. But outside of that, you'll never notice a difference in quality. How do I well, FaceTime you? Uh, you'll you. be running that through your... I wonder uh, how I FaceTime you... On an iPod Touch, because you're not normally. I would call your phone number. Is yours on well, right now? Is it in front of you? It is. You do it by email. So I do it by your email address. Yes. So what's uh, well? Okay, we can't do this out loud, but whisper. Well, you know, you can because everybody emails me. Oh, I'm, uh, I have 19 emails, but I'm on the Touch as uh, kidswithbiz at aol .com. Well, that's your normal address. Yeah. So people could okay. Well, let me let me uh, let me look you up here, and I'll if I guess if I add that to your contact yeah, information, we could. You're right. I can get rid of this computer. I get rid of all this lighting. We don't need all of that stuff anymore. Get rid of the Heil mic. Yeah, just do it by uh, iPod Touch to phone. Yeah, we, I can do it from Barnes and Noble. They have free Wi-Fi. Okay, here I'm gonna I'm gonna enter you in because I don't have you in my phone book. I don't really want to call you. Uh, let's see. And I'm going to do it by email. Giz. Right. Giz, and you may have to enter that in the FaceTime Giz. contact list. Or is that where you are? Oh, there's a FaceTime contact list. Yeah, I think it might bring up your... I think when you hit, hit, hit uh, add contacts, I think it brings up your other list. All right. Well, let me... let me. You got you have it in front of you? Yeah, yeah I do. I do. All right. Well, let me, let me call you. I'm calling you right now. Yeah, okay. It says I'm calling Duck because I mistyped your name. Okay. Do you see me? Do you see an incoming call? No. Do I need to have you as a you, contact? Maybe you have to need to have me. You in know there. what? I I think I do. I think I I think you have to be in here. Otherwise, you could just call. Yeah. Are you? Are you do, do you use your normal email for that? Uh, no, I use gizwizbiz at aol dot com. Oh. Maybe Plus that. Leo. <laughs> Plus Leo. Yeah, no, I have everybody send their email. If you want to email me, you know that. Do you email Dick? Yeah. Yeah. Right. But I can put you the email that I, I send stuff to you. Is that good? I think I'm Leo at Leoville. I don't know. I'm a phone number. Oh, oh. And I'm a duck. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Maybe it won't work it's between duck, iPhone. Duck, duck, Probably there's the chat room. Chat room. It's, it's, how, how do you do this? Chat room. I don't who, understand. There's someone well, it's not working. Too bad there's not a tech that. guy somewhere around here. <laughs> hey, the guy that's on Saturday and Sunday. Oh, no, he's not on anymore. He, no, he quit because yeah, you didn't get enough Twitter followers. He didn't get enough Twitter yeah. followers. Yeah. Well, I'll call him next week and uh, get the other guy from Brooklyn who'll be doing that show. I think, okay, try Leo at Leoville.com. Okay. All right. Let me see what, uh, see what happens. Ed, because I'm on. Uh, that's my mobile me address, and I presume okay. I would use my mobile me address. Okay, let me do that. Email. But that's just kind of neat. I mean, they needed to do something because really, you could only FaceTime when you were yeah. on Wi-Fi with other people who had iPhones on Wi-Fi. So it was very limited, you know. I don't, I don't, so my yeah, that's my Apple ID is Leo at Leoville dot com. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah so I, I would think that that would be what you'd what you'd use. What? This is so this is so galvanizing. This is just riveting, <laughs> riveting uh, content. <laughs> is your phone ringing? Not a oh, thing. Not no. A thing. I, Okay. What's your Apple ID? Uh, is, it, is it Gizwizbiz at AOL? I, I think it is, yeah. yeah. It says calling okay. me up. 
Hey, have you seen this new HRT audio uh, USB interface? Because it's... Yeah, you know, I have one of those. I have the more expensive one because I have stereo, so I needed two. Two. One, one for, for each right side. Channel. Yeah, for each channel. Yeah. Uh, one for the you left. You know, it, it wants it could call me again. Cause it, really? It's, 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 yeah. Really? But one, yeah. You see, you see a call from me? From me? It, it says calling Leo, and it says Leo's not available. Well, I'm calling, uh, I'm calling again. Maybe it doesn't... Maybe because I called you Duck? <laughs> uh, maybe maybe that's the problem. Yeah, uh, it's not doing it. That's all right. Hmm. Well, why shouldn't why shouldn't Wednesday mirror Tuesday? I ask you. Uh, <laughs> you could, uh, it's, uh, huh? Let's see what it says at support.apple.com. It, <laughs> <laughs> that, if, if this weren't galvanizing enough, yeah, exactly. Let's, let's exactly. log into the Apple support site and and see what it says. Here's a yes. Here's a tech note: iPhone for an iPod Touch using FaceTime. Uh, okay, you place a FaceTime call using the follow apps phone when on a phone call. iPod Touch. Place a FaceTime call using your contacts list. Tap the FaceTime icon to place a FaceTime call. But this is completely unhelpful. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't tell us anything we don't already know. Yeah, I know. Huh. Right. Okay, well. Uh, We're in each other's content. Don't run out and buy the uh, the uh, iPod Touch so you can make FaceTime calls. No. Unless you want to call another iPod Touch, then it's a breeze. Have you? But you've done that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I call. I, uh, Dennis has one, too. I've called him many times. Well, that's odd. And it rings. Yeah, it is. Okay, well, I'm done something wrong then, probably, as usual. No, if you could not do <laughs> two is, things wrong two is, days in a row. This is probably. often the yeah. case. Yeah. This might be the time to I just, I screwed it up somehow. Although, if it could get any more boring, it will. It's time for a letter. Okay, Lizzie Sullivan. Hi, Dick and Leo. I'm 16 years old. I live in Australia. Leo, I loved watching The Lab with Leo on Foxtel. And I love downloading the tech guy using iTunes. I just started downloading the videos of The Daily Gizwiz. And my question is, how can I listen to the first ever show so I can catch up to all the gadgets? On iTunes, you can only download episodes 1165 to the current ones that come out each weekday. I love uh, IT shows. I'll continue to download the stuff you guys produce. Keep up the good work. Lizzie Sullivan. Thank you, Lizzie Sullivan. 16 years old. That's, That's very nice. Good. I love it when we get the younger people. Yeah. The young, the young, the kids, the kids, the children from today. I love that. When they call, they write, they listen, they love. That's what I love. I love that back. It's a love fest. Yes. So we send them to Ludwig's site, right? Is that correct? Yeah. Gizwizsearch.com. Is that right? And um, I'm not sure. Gizwizsearch.com. Can you check that? I have a, my own staff here now. And then you should be able to, to uh, get every episode. We're checking it out. Gizwizsearch.com. And coming up is... Yep, that's it. How exciting. And the first Gizwiz yes. is... Easy to remember because all of the all of the gizwizzes are numeric. So, uh, and we start counting. Uh, you might be surprised to hear from the number one. So, if you go to twit.tv/dgw, followed by the number one, you will find the very first gizwiz episode on our. Oh, they'll go right there. Oh, goes there right go. to it. You don't even need to there search. There you go. And, Whoa! Uh, you press the little triangle. Somebody sent me an email saying, you know, you really ought to put a link that says, click this little triangle to play. <laughs> Do you think that's true? Because, I mean, is that confusing? 
Mm, Isn't that the universal the symbol for I click this little say, triangle to play? It's universally used. It's time for the Daily Gizwiz with Mad's Maddest Writer, Dick Very D. First Bartolo. One. This is episode one for February 20th, 2006, DocuPen. Support for the... I was so young and good looking then. Well, you know, FaceTime must work with a lot because a lot of people are calling They're you. They're all calling Facebook. you now? <laughs> That's very Why funny. Doesn't the, it work? The, the two hosts can't get through to each other. Total strangers are getting through. Total strangers are calling, but no. Can I call? No. Well, that's just very odd. Let me try again. Yeah. FaceTime. FaceTime duck. Uh, oh, wait a second. Wait, wait. Do you, do you see me? Yeah, I'd say, uh, is your phone number connecting, connecting? Oh, so maybe it was just it hadn't registered. The... There he is. Oh, oh okay. my God, it works. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Do you realize, Leo, that this might be historical because you're on the West Coast. Yes. I'm on the East Coast. Is this the first train? I keep trying to aim the phone at your I, face. I, I, all I see is a thumb. Oh, the, okay. The, now, take your thumb off the camera. <laughs> and now I'm only seeing the twit pillow. Well, I know because I can't. Okay, look, if I aim the phone at you, I mean at me, there, now you can see me. Yes. But then we're kind of at an yeah, angle on the perfect. camera. Yeah. It's perfect. Yeah, that's pretty no, good. it's perfect. Hey, Dick. Yeah. How hey, are you? Leo? So we'll use this from now on. I'm good. This is good. This is how we're going to do the Gizwiz from now on. Yeah, from now on. Yeah. This will be it. so much better. Tilt and the camera I'm, forward I'm a little bit. Screen. And then uh, I'm also on the TriCaster. Yeah. This is good. You know, it's actually quite a good well, picture. No, it's not bad. Yeah. And now let me just do that. Turn the camera around. Oh. And now we can look at some that. other people. We can see more people in the studio. Yeah. This is pretty cool. And da -da -da -da. Yeah, this is, I love this. Oh, I well, love good. From now this. on, instead of uh, calling you, I'll FaceTime you. Yeah. Well, I won't be able to get to you because I have about 50 other people who called me. So I'll be busy most of you know, you you have a face for FaceTime. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dick! All right, it's I'm gonna perfect. turn I'm gonna turn it around and show you the rest of my studio. So you you only oh, okay. you can see this there though. That that's that's our visitor from the uh, okay from very Houston, good. Houston Houston yeah. Texas and his wife. And look guy. how bored she looks. Guy, She's so bored. Look at oh, her. Yeah. See how bored she is. <laughs> Yeah. She's just, well, she's, what is the the uh, the initials that for widows that you use? LSS, long suffering spouse. Yeah, I had a couple of those at the meetup. Doesn't she look like she's suffering right now? The guy would come down with his wife and say, "Dick, this is my wife. She's she wants to say hello, and she's going shopping." She looks exhausted. <laughs> she's so bored. She teaches fourth graders, and she thinks we're juvenile. Yeah, yeah, we're childish. I, you know what? You, she went to the knitting store earlier. No, that's the other lady that was two bored. Afghans. <laughs> no, unfortunately, poor Laura doesn't even knit, so she's got nothing to do. She, oh, all she no. can do is slump and think, why is my life so bad? <laughs> How, what did I do to deserve this? And meanwhile, this? her husband will say, had the best day of my life. Yeah. It beat my yeah. wedding by a mile. Yeah. This is, so, this is what I've hoped for and dreamt for all my life. And Laura's going, I married the wrong man. <laughs> Gee, well, it's amazing what? what you could do for FaceTime. You don't see that on a FaceTime commercial. No, not oh, at all. Oh, wait a minute. Now, wait a minute. Now the staff isn't getting involved. Oh, now the staff word. wants to say hello. Oh, my word. The hey, Alex, Jammer B. This is beautiful, <laughs> isn't it, folks? Hey. Wow. This is great. Wow. This is Talk about leaving people out of a conversation. We've yeah, now done an okay. entire Let's podcast we'll, showing we'll people things down. they can't see. Right, because uh, I shut mine off. Because someone did write me and say, hey, you know... Don't leave out the audio people. Well, not even just the audio people. No one, even if you were watching video, you couldn't see what we were just showing. Because only oh, I was basically broadcasting to you, Dick. Yeah. Well, isn't that the way it's been for the past six yeah, years? Yeah. Because I don't. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. I asked. Uh, I asked Laura. A man who can't get ten thousand people to admit they know him. <laughs> Come on. I asked Laura if she was bored. She said, "No, I'm having fun." I said, "Well, I'm bored. Could you do the show? Because I'm really. <laughs> I can't. Okay, that's it. We're done." 
Uh, no, no, we didn't do a letter, did we? Oh, we did. Oh, I we beg to differ. Already you forgot the 16 year old. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot. I'll be here. D A I L Y. It's the day. its own gravy.